knockout against a Malaysian opponent. Indeed he did. All right, and there you can see the tail of the tape. Slight height advantage there for Luisi. And of course, much more experience for Fabio Luisi and two fighters with a tremendous win percentage record. We actually do have the um, French boxing Olympic team in the house here. It's apparently to watch a Maori prize. Wonderful. C'est magnifique. I thought, I, th I, th I thought your French no, ended at the beginning. It's coming back. Oh, it's nice. coming back to me. <laughs> but yes, we'll be an interesting affair. Don't think, as you said, we've had a France as a France matchup here on a tie fight. We, oui. we. Oui. Yes, we've never had one. <laughs> Good right hand there to the body. Attempting left up from Amori Prime. Stiff jab in reply by Fabio Luisi. He goes in once again with that left hand. Inside kick from Louis C. And again, utilizing that jab very nicely indeed. Yeah, and that's a fighter right there that knows how to use his reach to his advantage. You see him just picking his shots right now, just so accurate. Almost like a ball versus a matador here. Oh! Wonderful sweep there from Amari Prime. The ball just turned into the Matador. <laughs> See once again, the jabs being thrown there very nicely indeed by Fabio Luisi. And I think we can see early on that Luisi should stay on the outside against Amari Prime, because definitely on the inside, Amari has the advantage. Good strikes here coming in from the man from Marseille. Indeed, switching levels as well. Nice right low kick there in reply by Prime. Head on in with that right hand. Luisi just moving out of the way of that one. Left knee there by Prime. And again, two, three left knees. Got to say, he's really got to improve on his inside game, Luisi. Absolutely, yeah. He's struggling to defend that clinch. Inside kick from Luisi. Utilizing foot movement there. Again, going back to the body. It's almost a similar fight to uh, bout number one this evening, Nalpisad versus Pontery. Yeah, very we've similar that, indeed. We've got that flow, haven't we? The fighter who's happy to be on the back foot in Louis C. And we've got the shorter fighter trying to close the distance here in prime. Looking for elbows there. Oh, good knee to the midsection there from Louis C. Well timed to just staying out of range from Amari Prime. Doing a good job of that. I think he's learned early on to stay on the outside against Amari Prime. And it's working out for him right now. The output of Luisi though is very impressive. He's not stopped throwing and that's really putting off Amari Prime right now. He's having to defend more than he can attack. And again, look at that. One, two combination here from Luisi. Yeah, he's putting together both quantity and quality. Well done there from Luisi. And just times the shot so nicely. Don't write off Prime just yet though. You know that he possesses big power in those hands. End of round number one. Great round in my opinion from Luisi. Stay with us. It is Fabio Luisi from Marseille in the black corner and Amari Prime from Nantes in the white. And so far, it's been a good round, in my opinion, for Fabio Luisi. He was very good on the outside, struggled on the inside, though, against Amari Prime, as you can see in the replay. But when he managed to stay on the outside, it was good footwork, good placement of his shots, Ooh. just like that. And all around, a good performance. Just needs to keep it going. Yeah, great. <laughs> and Amari Prime for the majority of that round chasing shadows all right let's see what happens here in round number two and there's no doubt about it that Amari Prime is going to turn it up a notch big right hand there from Luisi who has also turned up a notch he 
really impressive output from Luisi, just non-stop. Mari Prime struggling to get going. Using those hands there, just to push Amari Prime away. And again, just can't close that distance. But if he can, like I said, he does possess big power. Yes, he does. And we know one thing from Fabio Luisi as well, he does have that power too. Good head movement, good, good head movement there from Luisi. That wasn't me mumbling, that was French. The, no, 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 the head movement just got you dizzy. Admit it. Right low kick there from Luisi. Back to the center of the ring again, switching angles, popping that jab. And again, tempted right hook, almost connects. Just so accurate, as if he's just entered the matrix. Indeed. This is a beautiful display here. Good left knee there. He did a good job there of defending the knees from Amari Prime. He was in the inside, knew that wasn't the best place for him to be, and managed to get out of it immediately. Oh, and again with that footwork. Left high kick from Luis C. Not just his hands, but now his feet's getting a workout here tonight. Tell you what, that jab though. That's the difference maker in this fight. Nice right hand to the body there from Luis C. Amari Prime trying to fling an elbow. There's that jab, doubling up. Step two right hands here from Amari Prime. Nice knee to the midsection though from Amari Prime. He's trying so hard to get to the inside with the footwork of Luisi, just too good at the moment. And just like in bout number one, we're seeing that those flurry of jabs start to mark up the face of the opponent. Here's Amari Prime, he's trying to scrap this one out. Yeah, Luisi, he was stuck in the corner just for a moment, but managed to get out of that situation really well. But right, low kick there. That's one way of slowing your opponent's legs down. Again, constantly moving, constantly attacking, Luisi is. Nice for Fabio. Yeah. Oh, digging a left up to the body. Oh, look at that. Such good movement we're seeing from Elisi, and again, Elisi, Luisi, ladies and gentlemen. Again on the inside, something we know that Luisi has not been good with. We're gonna have to do something about that tape on Luisi's hands there, but end of round number two, the final. <laughs>
Another right hand there from Luis C. Brian taking a lot of punishment to that nose of his. Surely difficult to breathe out of it right now. Yeah, no doubt about that. Taking a lot of shots so far. I feel like Prime is. Oh, another big right hand there from Luis C. Prime showing his toughness. Nice stepping knee. I feel like Prime's been sucking into fighting the style that Luis C. wanted him to fight, i.e., a, a boxing style matchup. Yeah, it seems that way. You know what people say is that you shouldn't be following your opponent, you should be trying to cut off the ring. But it's not a thing in Amari's case. There has been a lot of fo following in this. This so, match up here. It's almost like he wanted to show that he could outbox him, and I feel like he suffered for that. When he could, like I said, have been utilizing those low kicks. But let's not take anything away from Luis C. He's been fantastic here tonight. Yeah, it's been a very good performance so far. He's trying to evade the shots of Amari Prime at the moment. Luis C, you'd imagine he thinks he's done enough in this match. You would have to agree with him, surely, as well. I mean, look at the face right now of Amawi Prime. Tells his story in itself. There's that jab once again. Just floating around the tie fight ring superbly. A right low kick there from Amawi Prime. Oh, and a big elbow. Oh, but a massive right hand in reply from Luis C. And you see the corner of Luis C just in the back shot there of the camera. They're actually telling him to continue to move around the ring. Still, I think they still know that Prime does possess power. And Luisi was very slow to get onto his he feet was, there. Yeah. That's, oh, another big left hand as blood splatters from the nose of a Maori Prime. Prime raises his hands, but surely you would have to say it's Fabio Luisi over three rounds here on Tie Fight League. Yeah, I could agree with you more. I think he's definitely done enough to take this one. I'm looking forward to see once again here on Thai Fight. Yeah, it's 61 kilograms as well. Tall for his weight. Great footwork. Same weight as Kill Pit. I was just about to say the same thing, absolutely. Always thinking. There you can see at the end of round number three, Luisi just couldn't be caught. As Luisi dives under that elbow strike there from Maori Prime. And a bit of a taunt for him as well when he dodged that elbow. He was trying to find it. All right, we'll make this one official and then we'll be heading in. And the winner is... Black Corner, Fabio from France!